Welcome to the Stealth Channel, in today's video we will examine the US Air Force's next generation air dominance fighter. The US Air Force's next generation air dominance, or NGAD, program is described as a family of systems, with a sixth generation fighter aircraft as the centerpiece of the system, with other parts of the system likely to be unmanned escort aircraft to carry extra munitions and perform other missions. The fighter aircraft component of the NGAT program has been referred to as either the FX or the Penetrating Counter-Air or PCA fighter. This aircraft will be the subject of this video. The NGAT program was initiated in the early 2010s to develop an air superiority system for the U.S. Air Force by the 2030s. The program aims to develop several key technologies in areas such as propulsion, stealth, advanced weapons, digital design, and thermal management of the aircraft's signature. In June 2021, Air Force Chief of Staff General Charles Q. Brown told lawmakers that he wants the NGAD to have multi-role capability, emphasizing that the aircraft's primary role will be air dominance, but with the ability to strike ground targets as well. The NGAD will have some air-to-ground capability to ensure, one, that it can survive, but also to provide options for our air component commanders and for the joint force, Brown said, suggesting that the NGAD will be able to shoot at air defense systems that threaten it. Compared to the F-22 Raptor, Brown said the NGAD will have increased weapons load and increased range necessary to operate at the great distances required in the Indo-Pacific theater. The fighter is expected to leverage adaptive cycle engines being developed under the Adaptive Engine Transition Program and the Next Generation Adaptive Propulsion Program, with flight-ready engines expected by 2025. In September 2020, Will Roper, the Assistant Secretary of the Air Force for Acquisition Technology and Logistics, stated that a full-scale prototype of the NGAD fighter aircraft had already flown. This aircraft was designed, built and tested in just a year, thanks to virtual design and testing methods pioneered for this program. This rapid development schedule is unheard of in modern times. Also in September 2020, the Secretary of the Air Force Public Affairs published on the Defense Visual Information Distribution Service an interesting graphic for the Air Force's 73rd birthday. What catches the eye immediately is that the graphic features prominently, in the center and in the background, an unknown new aircraft that has not been confirmed as real or fictional. The timing was interesting as the image was published just days after Will Roper had announced that the Air Force has secretly designed, built and flown at least one full-scale prototype of a new generation fighter aircraft. The graphic seems to contain an image hidden within the image of this mysterious new aircraft. The U.S. Air Force published a story on Instagram in September 2020 related to their 73rd birthday. The story included a graphic that may contain Easter eggs as to the shape of the NGAD. The U.S. Air Force has a precedent of doing this such as when the B-2 Spirit stealth bomber was first publicly unveiled. At the bomber's rollout ceremony in 1988, the aircraft was stopped just outside its hangar with a star-shaped graphic on the tarmac just in front of the plane. Most did not understand the significance of the graphic at the time because the audience who were in attendance were only allowed to see the front of the aircraft. This graphic would also contain an Easter egg as to the aircraft shape. However, the noted aviation magazine Aviation Week and Space Technology rented a plane to fly over the ceremony location and took this overhead photo. It can be clearly seen that the star-shaped graphic contained the top view of five B-2s forming the shape of the star. In April 2021, the U.S. Air Force released its biennial acquisition report covering fiscal years 2019 and 2020. The NGAD is listed on page 28 of the report accompanied by some interesting artwork, which is shown here. In May 2021, General Brown, the Chief of Staff of the U.S. Air Force, stated that the NGAD will start replacing the Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor in the 2030s. On September 22, 2021, Reuben Hoffs posted a video on his Twitter account of a stealthy shape that closely resembles concept drawings of the NGAD being hauled by a flatbed truck at Lockheed Martin's Hellendale Radar Cross-Section Facility. The shape was carried upside down on the flatbed, and a pole mounting attachment can be seen underneath it as it was being transported. This shape is obviously a pole model being used for radar cross-section tests. Whether this shape resembles an actual design for the NGAD, or just a generic stealth shape being tested remains to be determined. Northrop Grumman posted an intriguing video on their YouTube channel on November 1, 2021. In this video, a female company tour guide takes us around the Northrop Grumman facility to show us various projects they are working on. 
The highlight of the video comes at the 12 second mark. Elevator doors open and the first thing we're shown is a mysterious and previously unknown aircraft at the front of the left side of the hangar. The tour guide then says, this is where we push the laws of physics, followed by, there's always something new in here. The camera quickly pans a bit to the right to show the entire hangar. On the right side of the hangar are legacy aircraft in Northrop Grumman Stable. These include MQ-4C Triton, the E-2 Hawkeye, and the F-A-18 Hornet. At the back of the hangar we can see the B-2 Spirit pulling into the hangar, while the B-21 Raider does a low-altitude flyby. On the left side of the hangar we can see projects under development. This mysterious new fighter design is up front. In the middle is a hard-to-see aircraft. Given its size in comparison to the two on either side of it, and its white color, my educated guess would be that it is the RQ-180 White Bat. Behind that is the X-47BU CAV. However, I came across this NGAD concept artwork released by Northrop Grumman in 2016. If you compare the aircraft in both images, you can see numerous similarities including a tailless platform and a pair of dorsal-mounted engine inlets just behind the cockpit. This artist's concept of an NGAD fighter was released by Boeing in 2019. This artist's concept of an NGAD fighter was released by Lockheed Martin. We look forward to learning more about this exciting and still largely classified program. Now that a prototype of the aircraft has flown, hopefully we will get to see a public unveiling of this exciting new aircraft in the near future. I will endeavor to upload a new video each week so make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell to know when I have uploaded a new video. I hope you will enjoy this content and continue to come back for more.